And hello guys, I would like us to work on this steel water tank 50,000 liters in Prota Structures version 2022. So we, we launch our Prota Structures. The height is 9 meters high. As the height of the tank mm, so if you convert this 50 liters you will go to get like 19 depends on the on the on the on the area you convert it to liters you convert these liters to kg then from kg now you can be able to convert it to kilometer kilometer kiloton I divide it by the area you want to use yeah and make sure that the area I make sure that the volume equals to 50 thousand liters so now but when you come here now this is new you type steel tank choose the code we want to use give it time to load so when we start now yeah the our software has opened the first thing will come to modeling without wasting time left click this grease I left click anywhere here we can change this to 2000 multiply by 2 2000 multiply by 2 okay then now Edit. Then you can just insert the number of stories. The height is nine thousand thirty-three meters. So let's let's insert four stories. One to be our DPC. So now, then we'll see edit story. The first one here will be 300 mm the RC, the rest will be steel. 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 Mm -hmm. Okay. So now that we are done here, we come to we'll start start here. You can just start here. And we we'll come to story two where we can insert our steel columns. Come here steel. Click on columns. Give it time to wait to load. Open here. You can load from here. On the universal beam here. Let's say we are choosing the universal beam. We select. Select. And we want to have all of this we have beam. Okay. Views 3D. There we have this now. Just go back to this story and put concrete beam to concrete column. 
this is our concrete column will be 350 by 350 let's put it in 3 okay that's what we have here As it is now, we can also repair. We can come to story. What? Let's okay. Let's come back to our story one, story two. I would draw our struct. Struct beams. They come to beams again. Open here. I use angle let's try Malaysia universal angle 75 by 75 by you yeah universal angle let's try 70 by 70 by 6 close here close here let's see there is area also Yeah. 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 We do. Go there. You can close this now. Okay, this is what we have here. So, so now we can generate. Before we generate stories, let's just add brace, pick brace, select one, two. Give it time. Okay. So this is brace. This is 65. We maintain the 65 for now. We can also change it. Depends. CC this count. You can change this count to two. Look at good. We now have this. So let's say we change the count to two. We have that. Yeah. Do the same thing. Now we can generate story. Generate story. Copy two. Bring with you three and four. Correct. Exactly what we want. Can delete this one here. Yeah. 
usable so we're having an offset of 1000 cantilever beams so the offset Press F2. No. F2. One thousand. Oh no. So like this, offset F2, 1000, escape again, so like this, offset, minus 1000, so like this, offset, And it's one thousand and now modeling also is then this will pick beams for primary beams. Let's pick primary beams, you guys are beams. Come back to British. Let's try this. Start from here, ends here. Let's see. Starts from here, ends here. Start from here, ends here. Let's take a look at it in 3D. Good. Let's progress. Okay, so now that we are done, let's go back to this floor. So the trick that I use here to for the secondary beam now, I use pull lines. Still, come to pull lines. Yeah, you pick pull lines there. So good. So here now, I choose universal beam of this. Mm -hmm. Okay, the spacing I may use 500. Then left can deliver on the left. Let me try this by 1000. It was H O. Okay, this space to here. Mm, Two hundred. It's fine. Depends on what you want them. Come to sag rods. I'm not sure if there is none. So let's finish. You can see good. Yes. Done what I wanted. See, repeat the same process. Right. Left, right. Pull line. Left, right. Five hundred, one thousand. Pull line again. 
plant right plants right let's try now left right let us see what we have here hello left okay let's come to modeling again let me do this to check something good i'm doing the opposite first i was picking left and right then it was offsetting this side but now i can pick right and left to offset this side or right and left or i can pick left and right and then come on carry this 1000 and bring it down here you still have the same results Okay, I think we are done with this. Good, you can see, you can see my secondary, see my secondary beams. Okay, perfect. So now I can proceed to put my cladings. So now that we are done, we will. Come back here and add our cladding. So we don't need to pick this. And cladding comes. Okay. Pick this. To add. Pick this. And pick this okay we are, we are done and save Come to loading, load cases and combination, load generator, horizontal, wind, tick this. Load cases have been generated, we can close this. Then now uh, Under loading now, we are at story 4 now. So you can see load editor and story 4. We'll open that. Okay. Make sure you are using rectangular full, full uniform area load. So the G is for dead load. You can have added a load of 19.4. This this dead load is gotten from from this from this 50,000 liters. Well, well, we we know our area is five meter by five meter. Good. So this this dead load is gotten from from the 50,000 liters. But by the time you convert the liters to 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 kg then you now convert kg to kilonewton then you now divide by the area or whatever liters you are using the process is the same so it's from my calculation i got 19.4 okay, okay. 19.4 so now i begin to Put this load
good We are done with this can come the queue Blue which is live load go to the top see our live load this is 0 0.6 we will add it been added I click OK so if you if you have loads that you want to add by the sides the process is the same you add your cladding just as I added cladding here apply the loads on it so now we come to analysis analysis here mm. do the analysis let's say at setting center Foundation. Let's say this is 150 for example. This is this. reinforcements. You want to use don't want to use top bars to take that off. All right. Edit materials. If there is anything you need to edit here, like call the grades and stuff like that, you do that. So from here now, go from building check. Everything seems to be okay. Close it. We can run building analysis. If you like your design first and run your analysis, or you, you design once. the design
okay this is done I can come to analysis look at click on the analytical model what we have here a lot of these things that you can, can check here But this is the deformation. Come to view. You can have the display, visual interrogation, design status. Let's check our design status. See that everything passed. It's perfect. Check. Check this column. Give it time. You see that all the members passed. Let's select this. Right click. Steel design. Part of the visualization ratio for combined forces zero point. Axia. Okay. This is okay. That is good. Let's check these primary beams. The utilization ratios. Okay. It's a bit the primary beams are a bit higher. You can you can actually choose something less and that will bring these things close to 0 0.75689 so this these beams can be reduced let's see for this Okay, zero point is very very enough. And this zero point well, okay. So we can can come back to story zero zero. Also insert no part. Not to design all at once. That's one way to do it, but I prefer to design one after the other.
from 0.1 like this I like moving it to I like odd numbers move that to 1.2 Scan this one is higher. Carry second lever. have this so I think this is what we need so from here now from here I think we are done with our design so we can be able to now export we can export this the concrete parts to proto structures while we now export the steel part to protest to you and do our connections or we can use any other connection software and insert the loadings on it and get what we want so thank you for watching if you find this, this video useful please remember to subscribe my channel and share to other people that also need to benefit from this knowledge Have you been desiring to get an exclusive design for your dream home? Or you have been looking out there for an expert firm to handle your project? HE Structures has got you covered. HE Structures is a consultancy company registered with the Corporate Affairs Commission of Nigeria to deal in providing world-class standard services with a view of ensuring clients need timely. HE Structures deals in structural design, analysis, and modeling of buildings, telecommunications mast, bridges, culverts, retaining walls, swimming pools, and drainages. We are also experts in architectural designs and modelings of residential, commercial, and industrial buildings. We have a strategic way of remodeling of structures to classic taste. Our remote software training ranges from AutoCAD, Revit, ProtoStructures, Autodesk Robot Structural Analysis, Quick Civil Series, Tecla Structures, SAP 2000, Lumion, and so on. You can reach us on WhatsApp and website displayed on the screen. You can also subscribe to our YouTube channels displayed.